Hi, this is Heidi Caswell here, WordPress 101 for Beamers, and we've been talking about moving from Blogger to WordPress on a self-hosted site. And just a few minutes ago, we went ahead and introduced you to a very cool plugin, um, SEO Blogger to WordPress migration using 301 redirection. And uh, we also showed you how you could go into your Blogger account and you can put a um, you can redirect the feed to go to your new WordPress site. It'll look something like that, and then you'll hit Save Changes on it. And then we're going to go ahead and go back into more on using this uh, plugin to redirect your pages when people go to your site. Um, because when you go to your WordPress site, um, up at the top you'll have pages, and a lot of them will have the name of your post, um, it'll have a day, the year and the and month, things like that on there, and uh, this will um, make so when people click on these old, like this one says connectsimply.com slash dot blogspot.com slash, it'll kind of change that so that it will, when people link on the old links, they're going to go ahead and go to your new site. So let's go ahead and get started. We went ahead and we installed and activated the plugin. So it's up there and it's ready to go. And um, if you also go over to the plugin site, they kind of have some directions and things that you can use on that. So it'll help you out. As you can see right here, this is an additional step. Now, if you're using your domain name already on Blogger, you don't have to do the step. Everything's taken care of for you. However, if you've been using uh, name.blogspot.com, then there's another step that you'll need to do. And so we're going to go ahead and go into Tools, and um, let's check this out. SEO Blogger to WordPress. And this is showing you your, where your current uh, WordPress URL is. As you can see, it has directions where to go into the blog uh, at HTML and just how to copy this into the text area and save it. What you do is you just generate code. You can see the generated code here, and this is what you're going to copy and paste and put in there like they show up there. Okay, over here you're in Blogger. And... Um, you would be going into um, your template. Edit HTML. And then you, you would go ahead and add that code in here. And then save it. Now, if you've already got your domain name going over to Blogger, it's already been mapping there, skip the step. Just installing the plugin, it's taken care of it for you. Uh, the next thing that you want to do is you want to have your images moved in. And so what you do is you go ahead and you just click on this. The download. I'm not sure how well it's going to work on here because I only have some of my posts there. I did not put them all in there. I believe some of them we were just working on that. Well, there these posts were updated. The images were imported and they were put on the post. Very, very cool. I can go back in to my um, media library and I can see these uh, new images are already showing here, these ones that, had, that they pulled in. Some other places that I was at. I'm not sure it pulled too many in. Okay. Um, the post that I use the Blogger importer with, which is what I used on here, uh, and I just did just the one post that had a few images there. But those images, if I were to uh, look at the images, uh, they actually are uploaded now onto my new site, and they got moved. Uh, some other things, I had to convert the Blogger export and switch it over to WordPress, and on those, it didn't move the images. So you have to be able to do that. Have fun.